Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, yes, and so welcome much. back to a new episode of Morrowind. In the last episode, we took care of Ralph's Tenem uh, up will at the uh, cave Shalit on this small island over here. And we also got a quest by. Let me just do. Uh, we also got a objective or quest from Ame Musa camp to find a white gar where path is forked and the rocks uh, grow out like fingers in a hand um, so yeah uh, not much else happened except we took care of Brad's animal obviously we got epic loot uh, I mean just took l take a look at this ring Marara's ring Reflect 20%, Fortify Skill Acrobats 10%, Resist Normal Weapons 40%, that's obviously quite good. Um, yeah, now, two things I must say. Uh, I accidentally leveled up, um, accidentally used Enchant so much because I used the Fighter Ring, uh, the ring I got from Angrodel in episode 31, and Feather Shield plus Adrenaline Rush to just carry the loot back and forth. Yes, I did sell it all, and... I did get, like, 1,500 gold or something. It's not terrible. Um, but, yeah. Also, today... is the most epic and important day of Morrowind. So, if I press T, look at here. Today is the 23rd Frostfall and it's currently 2 p.m. but do you notice something very important? it is the 69th day Whoa. yeah it's 69 Lama. Lama. and uh, it's very epic day today now everything will be quite a change we will level up to level 5 if I can just find a bed somewhere we will get new equipment because this is all new. So we have been using this since episode 15, so we've been going off quite a while. But I have been thinking if we change out uh, the Imperial Dragon Scale Curse to the Imperial Silver Curse. Oh damn, boy. You are thick. <laughs> Whoa. Um, change out the. Storm Helm, which we also got in episode 15. Si 15, 16, 17, I don't quite remember, but we got it while we were in Caldera down here. Um, so there we go, and also change out the Greaves. And perhaps we need to get more pants Ooh, because speak. it looks like shorts on him. Now he looks absolutely ridiculous. Uh, yeah, yeah, oh my goodness, just look at that. <laughs> His body go through the his legs. Uh, perhaps we should not change the curves after all, I've changed my mind. But we change the helmet and we change the greaves. Now, reason for the greaves is really 10 weight and it's medium armor, which is something we use. That is 17 and it have worse armor rating, so it's obvious just gonna slow us down by quite a bit. Um, so we do not want to do that. But yeah, I mean, let's just get going. Um, I would assume, because of how Marwin's questing works, that the area would be nearby this ish. So if I just like maybe look for road, um, then we should be good to go to find that gar. Still do not want to go down there because I don't know how friendly or unfriendly they are. But I could really use some resting. Actually, no. Let's not do resting. We need to do this all within 69 days. 
so it's very important that we finish it today um, with Reverie's tiny shorts. <laughs> um, do I have a healing potion though? Actually, um, let me do sugar kick. So my, I think I should be able to cast fail the casting the spell. Okay, there we go. Um, then I use a stand magic up. See now. While being as most likely going to survive because of my healing spells, I most likely will die a lot, but that's okay, because we need to do this in 69 days. The theme of this episode is 69. And if I have not repeated myself enough, the theme of this episode is 69. <laughs> we we'll most likely get tired of the 69 meme after this video, I assure you. <laughs> But, yeah, it is how it is going to be. Not sure if what. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm not even five minutes in and I die. A few moments later. Hmm. Good thing I died there because I just realized that I was actually streaming. At, uh, streaming. Recording at 8,000. 18,000 instead of 3,000 what I usually do so I apologize deeply for the beginning the quality of the beginning I hope you could put up with it though but it was not intentional so there is the camp now I want to tell you a funny story oh boy that's the very disgusting thing we fought at episode 15. Look at that thing! What is that? I'm gonna zoom in. What is that thing? My goodness. Oh, I, I still want to throw up just looking at it. It's just so... Ugh. It's not that I have anything about against bugs in general, it's just that the combination of how it looks is just... Ugh, no, please. It's disturbing. <laughs> mm, do I not have any standard restore fatigue potion? Why am I so poor? <laughs> sure, okay. Let's do that. Oh my, oh it's even two, my god. They seem to be powerful too. Run Rabina, come on, god damn it. Run! <laughs> Run away from here! <laughs> they are disgusting! Too bad that the Morrowind AI sucks, so the town folk will not help us. I'm just gonna rest in here for a second. That's not allowed. I need to be as efficient as possible. I need to wait for one hour. And we have like 12 minutes to finish this episode. <laughs> Quickly, Outlander. Oh. Do you hear the battle cry, Barbina? This is not epic. Why bad things happen to good people? Oh my god, that's your fault for stand going in between me. <laughs> Rabina, you are brave. I could not face them in for the life of me. If everyone just had a friend like Rabina. My god. 
Let me just dispose of it, of course. I do not want my to be tortured anymore. I think because of I'm not allowed to rest because of my own rules, I think my best chance is to be shooting bolts from a distance. You have contracted with Bane. It was a deceased rat. Gosh darn, that's not cool. Uh, do I have any cure diseases? No. Unfortunately, I do not. Oh, what is that? It looked like a finger. A few moments later. Oh, maybe we should follow this road, see where it takes us. I mean, it is a road, and she said something along the lines like where the f uh, path was forked or something. I still have good memory, even though it was a month <laughs> uh, after me recording that last episode. I should really upload more often. Oh, who is that over there? Should I draw off my weapon? Maybe. I mean, he looks harmless. He's probably harmless. Hello? Eighth and ninth. Here we get quick. Oh, I should probably enable subtitles too. Uh, there we go. Subtitles. Stranger. Yes, you. Please, can you help me? I've been attacked by a couple of bastard Atlanders who robbed me and left me for dead. Bastard Atlanders? I know them everywhere. They look like kind of like dark, normal dark elves, but wild. War animals killing them had tattoos. And they had our head. That should be easy to spot from. It's no surprise they robbed me. Robbed you? What do you mean? Yes. The bastard didn't want to nearly kill me, and it took my entire shipment of gore hides. Seize it to tell they are mine. They had my damn mark on them. Look, if you can help me get those hides back and kill the fetcher who stole them, I promise you an extra reward. Although I have nothing left since I was attacked, my friend Bourbon in Talmora will be most generous, I promise you. What do you say? I see if I can find those hides for you. Excellent. Go get those bastard Archlanders. I promise when you get those hides back to me, Burwin will be ge very generous. She has a stake in this trade. After all, we can't let an unwarranted attack on a Guarhai trade ruin business. That's what happened, alright. Fetchers to all of them. He have not been having an epic time on this 69 days. The trader, Etherin Garion, claims he has been attacked by two Ashlanders who robbed him and left him for dead. Gareth has described the Ashlanders that attacked him. They looked kind of like a normal dog elf, but well. They wore animal skins and had tattoos, and they had odd hair. This may not be narrow down my search as much as I had hoped. Geert claims that the Ashlanders have stolen his shipment of gar hides, and he would like my help in getting them back. If I can retrieve the stolen hides, his friend Bourbon and Tamora will reward me. I will agree to try and hunt down the missing gore hides for Athen and Gareth. It will be best to check with the local Ashlanders first. Yes, I should do that once I have gotten the white gar. Oh! Is that the white gar? This is where the path forks, and rocks grow like fingers on a hand. And it's white! You know what? I can't do this save, I must do. <laughs> Epic title, yes. White guard, please stop. Stop, please. Hey. Stop, please, stop, I want to talk to you.
car, please stop. What? I should follow it, maybe. Where is he taking me? Floating albino white guard, oh master sensei, where are you taking me? Oh, what's this? I have found the white guard. Once I got in the range of it, the needle began to move west. Guard led me to a cluster of rocks and trees. Here I found the corpse of a woman who looks like she once was a healer. Ashamanu. Cure blind disease on self, restore health fight. Hmm. What was their original objective? Was it to find that woman? The blight, yeah. So that—that's why. Uh, I see. I see. Maybe I should go back to the camp now. Thank you, White Guard, uh, Alabino Guard of the uh, Master Sensei Pool. But we should move backwards. Let me just take this rat. You will die like a rat, red guard. Ironic. Since we were fighting a rat. Let's go back to the camp and while we're there, let's talk to uh, the uh, girl. <laughs> I don't remember her name. Something something. <laughs> let's call her something something. Uh, le anyway, let's talk to the something something and then uh, also ask if she has seen anyone with gar heights. And that's a Daedric Ruin I would like to go in, but I'm fear I'm not able to go because I'm probably too weak. Hmm. Oh. Let's bring out our maze. No, it's not. Okay, cool. Should be at the camp soon, but I skip. Um, I see you at the camp. Tell me what you have found. You have seen in my. Tell me what you. Tell me what you have found. You who have seen in my visions. Have you found what God? I've seen your journey in your vision. I know what the white car led you to. And I know who she was. In my vision, I saw you were led to the corpse of Ashamanu. She was a healer many, many years ago. She gave her own life to save the lives of others. It said that she will give her life again and again, so that others may live through her sacrifice. You have witnessed a miracle, my child. You now hold the amulet of Ashamanu. Thank you, child. This amulet will be the salvation of my people. Take this in return. It is a shield of legend among my people. The shield of Elndonta. Use it, and you will feel the strength return to their limbs. Travel well, friend. Thank you very much, but... Have you heard about the attack on a Guarhard trader? No, we have not done the same. The ones you are looking for are Emoran and Kashir as... El... El... Abel. They are outcasts belonging to none of our tribes. You should be able to find themselves here, along the water's edge. May I bring them swift justice. Was those the person we saw with the white guards? 
<laughs> the white cars. I mean, there was a white car and there were like two people there. Maybe that's them. Uh, what shield did she give me? There it is. Shield of the Undaunted. Restore fatigue. I mean, it could be useful for like a very close situation where you might die. But it looks cool. We must use it because this is the 69 day we serve everyone. Um, go right away, diseased creature. Go away, diseased creature. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm only a whipping. Not like it's not like I'm a vampire or something. Anyway. Let's go to them then. <laughs> Still have two minutes left to do that. Mm, if I wait for an hour because I really need to get my fatigue up. To at least have a fighting chance. I think that's them. Let's in uh, decrease our FOV. <laughs> Oh my god, they are evil twin. <laughs> oh my goodness, Mudcrab. <laughs> Epic. Wait, why is combat music playing? Enemies on him, why? What? Well, never mind, it was just a rat. Do we just confront them or do we like. Wait, let's see, save. Um, Gar hide trader. Trader. <laughs> Attacker. Eh, something all along, that's probably fine. Do we go up to them? Do they turn hostile immediately? You're unclean now, Blender. Get away from me and go get cured. Or stay away from me. Your pain is nearing an end. You are suggesting it, that thing? That is fine now, Red Card, for it is true. Kershus and I have taken the hives in our pumps and, and in our possessions they will remain. Prepare, prepare to meet your gods, for none may take what it is now. Oh, the end of you. oh. <laughs> perhaps I should heal Rabina up a little bit too. There we go. Now one final. There we go. Epic. Uh, and great healing ring of healing. I forgot I had it. Hmm. Scroll of Vitality. You know what? Let's use it. I'm still under the roof. We are not allowed to use uh, any resting because it's 69 day. We had to do everything epic today. Um, I think I still want to go out with my crossbow. Uh, let's see. There is no escape. What if I can use reach you and die like can't I can't use die. adrenaline rush? Well this fight will be tough then. Nice hex, bro. Okay. Now let's go, let's go, let's go. I have a bit more courage now that I have like the ring because it's resist normal weapons more so I can like go in more <laughs> let's go Rabina we got this nice hacks bro why you use hacks what if I like take the damage come on stupid thing Hit 
him, hit him, come on. Oh, she died. Not cool. You will die like a rat, red guy. Come on, he's almost dead. That's the thing, it's really irritating. Die, please. <clears throat> yes! Come on, Warbino, we got this! Get him! Get him! Come on! I take the damage for Ru, Rabina. I will not let you die. I will get this dude. We will get this guy together. Come on! Yes, you go get the mud crab arena. Use the bomb and that, that I brought down in, up in Telmora. Come on. Yes. And then, yo, Barbina! We did it! We stopped crime on 69 day. And away 10, OMG. <laughs> Should really have like gone to sleep earlier so I could level up. Hmm. Is there like a hotel of the town? Actually, how is my adrenaline? No. Hey, I, I, I'm such a retard. <laughs> There's still the fighter ring which increased up to 60. So if I like just take the Gar height pack and then later I come back for that um, because I still will not have the carry weight for it. I need to finish this before 69 days over. Epic montage music begin. Still 69 day and we made it! Yeah! If there's anything I can do, I am humbly at your service. What? Was there more? Very sad times, guys. I think I've failed 69 day challenge. <laughs> but that will not stop us. Even if 69 days over, 70 day will bring us new luck and all the other days after this. So we must retrieve those good guard heights. I will do it now.
Okay, finally. Jeez, that took a lot of time because I first I had to get back to Bourbon because I saw them, <laughs> and then I had to go all the way back to Gurneth. But I, hey, Gurneth, I'm finally here. I I, I will say Gurneth. Gurneth because are ruined. I will call you Gurneth because I cannot pronounce your first name. But yeah, let's go. Uh, Gurneth robs hide. Thank you for getting them back. It's good to hear you were able to make those picture pay as well. Make sure to see Bourbon in Telmora for your reward. Said I send word along trade routes to make sure she keeps an eye out for the rules I seek. Thank you, mate. Glad that you are happy with it, but yeah. Uh, now I had to get back to Telmora as well to just be able to finish this quest. But it's not too far. I mean, I, it's worse than when when we had to. Oh, not wanted to move that. Uh, when we like had to go all the way from Balmora all the way to Cedric Mora. So uh, yeah, I learned after that route. I have learned not to complain about the distance traveling because my God, was that a long trip from Balmora to um, Cedric Mora? But it was so much worth it. I mean, we have had powerful stuff like the ring and even had good edited episode by Matt because my imagination is big brain my imagination is big brain what even is grammar in English <laughs> well anyway I see you back in the Tamora okay finally we are at bourbon oh. so ah my friend Murphus how may I be of service well I have um, taken care of Gareth's problem and he said that you will give me his pay. Ah, my old friend Garrett. I heard you helped him out of some serious trouble not long ago. Some business with a couple of no good Ashlanders, right? Then they will learn. Anyway, yeah, my thanks. Quite an investment in those scar hearts. Would have been taken quite a beating had a girl not been able to sell them. Here, take this as our appreciation. Ring of Horn Hand. My imagination should not become dirty. <laughs> so we, if we move away from, uh, okay, do not get stuck in those rocks again, please. Alright, that's good. So if we move away to like something like where the scrib is currently, um, we can possibly, unless it, yeah, it's counted as part of the town. What if we go over to... Oh, never mind. Here we go. Um, I think I want to rest for an hour, maybe. Level up. Level 5. There we go. Uh, uh, if we just do rest... You have ascended to level 5. And this is great news. Everything we do is just a bit easier. More instinctive. More satisfying. It is as though you suddenly develop keen senses and instincts. Now that's good news. And of course, as I said earlier, uh, endurance level 77 now. Um, that's very cool. Strength level 72. Um, and who should we pick? Should we just pick? luck for once so we got like maybe we take luck up to level 10 or 15 nah, well we take luck this level just to get it a little bit higher I guess so ladies and gentlemen this episode have been going on for roughly about 30 minutes and so I think it's a perfect time to end right here in today's episode we have been doing the epic 69 episode where we the entire day did not spend any waiting uh, because we wanted to finish a lot of stuff in the 69 episode 69 episode the 69 day fortunately it's 70 now but we did a we did um, we find a white gar and we helped the, the tribe uh, north of Voth and we also helped a, a, a trader gar high trader by the name of Gareth 
who uh, apparently got attacked by Ashlanders, who killed the Ashlanders, took their hides, took it back to Gareth, and then got the payment from uh, Berwin. And yeah, that was... I mean, it's not the most exciting thing in the world, but it was a decent episode. I really enjoyed it. Because I probably will put in a lot of enjoyable content in it. Um, but yeah. Um, thanks so very much for watching this episode. And i see you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.